मॉर्निंग ये बर पेपर टेक अट थैंक यू सर श्री विद्या यस सर श्री विद्या इंट्रोड्यूस योर सेल्फ सर माई नेम इज श्री विद्या मिश्रा आई कम फ्रॉम ढेंकाना डिस्ट्रिक्ट आई हैव कम्प्लीटेड माई ग्रेजुएशन फ्रॉम शिक्षा अनुसंधान यूनिवर्सिटी भुवनेश्वर आई कम्प्लीटेड माई पोस्ट ग्रेजुएशन फ्रॉम विश्व भारती यूनिवर्सिटी वेस्ट बेंगाल एंड सिंस देन आई हैव बीन प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर वेरियस कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स ओके सो कैन यू जस्ट टेल बिकॉज यू हैव डन मास्टर्स इन एग्रीकल्चर एग्रोनॉमी सो वट इज द चेंजेस रिक्वायर्ड इन इंडियन एग्रीकल्चर to uh, fulfill the dream of uh, the prime minister double farmers income but the big dream the yes, prime sir. minister it is a to double farmers income but the changes required sir first changes that is required uh, farmers can go from monocropping to crop diversification very good uh, sir the second is uh, uh, they will be more involved in making value added products for example mm-hmm. in case of maize Uh, time comes when the, uh, in case of distress cell the maize goes to be two per kg uh, so in that case if we go for value added product like corn flakes making or corn starch then it will be sell definitely at a higher rate than the only crop uh, so then third uh, okay then what are the challenges in this way if this is the thing then what are the challenges in achieving this what are the challenges to achieve this sir uh, old age practice that farmer are not able to um, far, generally it is a common um, it is our uh, mindset that we are not ad- we are not easily adapted to a new technology so it is uh, so first challenge is that to pursue the farmers mainly to go for the value added production second is to the uh, they should be properly uh, given training for um, uh, crop diversification practices they should be given they should be given adequate knowledge for what should be the benefits then only these challenges can be overcome infrastructure infrastructure yes sir for like uh, uh, post harvest operations their proper infrastructure should be given cold storage facilities uh, that should be given for the farmers these you know are the, the scheme called mega food park food park yes sir mega no. food park yes sir so where it is established in odisha which district got odisha's first mega food park uh, sir at raigada yeah meets Yes, so what what do you know about this mega food park scheme sir mega food park scheme is basically in which uh, multi uh, various facilities will be available starting from the post harvest operations to till uh, marketing uh, in that place the uh, various cold storage uh, structures are developed uh, for proper storage facilities are developed so that the products would not be destroyed and would be kept for a long period of time okay yes. so what is the what how much you feel the need of corporate uh, entry to indian agriculture entry of corporate sector to indian agriculture how far you feel its importance or its necessity entry of corporate sector to indian agriculture sir first would be that if there is entry of corporate sector then there would be definitely a marketing platform for them um, for example like reliance uh, for example like uh, reliance yes sir for reliance Various uh, marketing practices have been done by Reliance. For example, uh, Reliance is opening their uh, GeoMart stores where farmer, where organic food pro- products are also being sold from remote places. Uh, sir, I am only. Uh, uh, remote only. Yes. So is it is it going to be challenge to the farmers entry of the corporates? Is going to affect the common small and marginal farmers of the country? Sir, I am unable to. Okay. Answer. So what is contract farming? Yes, contract farming is a farming in which there is an agreement between the buyer and the uh, producer. Uh, the the uh, yes, this is mainly the definition of contract farming. Then, what is the advantage of the uh, cultivator and the advantage of the buyer? Sir, buyer, uh, the person who is the cultivator, he gets a land, he gets to uh, some amount of uh, price is fixed between them, so that that. Uh, so he is not to bother about the. customer customer yes sir okay. the entire marketing would be done by the uh, buyer and he has to only employ his uh, skills uh, while pro- while production of the crop only and that amount that would be fixed to the ratio that would be fixed between the buyer and the uh, farmer producer uh, that would be only shared between them and and, and what is the benefit to the uh, buyer uh, in a contract sir, he, ha- he, do- he he has not he has uh, he has no la- he do he doesn't have to take any responsibility for the farm whether uh, he has to only uh, 
इकोनॉमिक Cabinet Committee of Economic Affairs. Cabinet Committee of Economic Affairs. It is it is for 22 crops plus one that is sugar cane. Sugar cane is FRP. FRP. What is FRP? Sir, FRP stands for Fair and Remunerative Prices. Why? How is it different from the MSP? Um, sir, in um, MSP we uh, MSP the, the if the food grain the general the food grain is uh, food grains or the crops are directly. Um, in cotton is in MSP. Yes, sir. Cotton Copra is. Copra in MSP. Yes, sir. Hmm. Um, so uh, in uh, sh- FRP is only for sugar cane because in that the mills take a guarantee for uh, the uh, for the processing of the sugar cane. Whereas in MSP, they directly the food uh, the directly product is brought to the uh, in front of the government. Okay. Yes, yes. Can you sing? Yes, sir. Sing. Sir, I can. Can I go for a patriotic song, sir? Oh, but sh- that should not make us stand. Yes, sir. <laughs> Definitely. <sir. coughs> इतनी शक्ति हमें दे न दाता मन का विश्वास कमजोर हो ना इतनी शक्ति हमें दे न दाता मन का विश्वास कमजोर हो ना हम चले ने एक रस्ते पे हमसे दूर कर भी कोई भूल हो ना इतनी शक्ति हमें दे न दाता मन का विश्वास कमजोर हो वेरी गुड वेरी गुड वेरी गुड एक्सीलेंट यू हैव यू हैव गिवन अस वन एक्सप्रेस वन हॉबी देन व्हाट यू विल फीड अस बिकॉज़ यू कुक द यू आर कुकिंग इज योर हॉबी सो व्हाट यू विल गिव अस टू इट सर फर्स्ट इज टी Hmm? Uh, tea or coffee? I will definitely uh, ask for whether if anyone if okay. asks. Okay. Hey, tea, coffee, we don't want. You tell us what you will take. Sir. Uh, what do you cook the best? Sir, I cook best is in case of vegetarian foods. I generally I like vegetarian than non-vegetarian foods. So I like to prepare uh, the food dish that is very common in our Indian household that is santula mm-hmm. from uh, different kinds of vegetables. Okay, good. मैनेजमेंट ऑफ लैंड for the production uh, purpose okay so which land is best suitable for this cotton cultivation so black cotton soils okay why why what, what makes the soil black sir black is mainly due to the presence of the titaniferous uh, compound that is uh, which and also due to the it is rich in humus what is the ph value of the soil so ph value what is Six, ph value so ph is the activity of hydrogen and activity in a solution Uh, and it uh, so the ph value of black cotton soils is 6 to 7.5 my last question what is soil health card sir soil health card is uh, the card which may, which com- which encompasses 12 uh, so, uh, pri- primary and secondary nutrients it mainly uh, it mainly helps the farmers to know what is the fertility status of the soil very good sir okay sir vidya mishra yes sir okay. so you passed in 2022 you have any work experience No sir. Only two, two years passed. What are you doing now? Only for complete exam or? Uh, uh, yes sir. Why were you just for the bank job? Sir, bank job, sir, because bank is a financial organization, yeah, which may it is mainly, uh, it is one of the honest job, sir. Actually, bank is one of the honest job, 
and bank mainly deals with the um, transactions that are made for all, for all types of society, people belonging to all kinds of all types of society it is mainly for business people it is for the rural upliftment of the rural people also and also for the middle class people you told that honest job what does what do you mean the honest job uh, sir uh, 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 no other jobs are honest uh, yes sir other jobs are honest but if we see the reports as per the government reports then the uh, less than 1% uh, corruption takes place in the bank se banking sectors that's why it is an honest job sir okay very good so you will post as a say, agent say finance officer or a rural development officer what yes, will be your job profile do you know do have any idea about that job Uh, yes sir first is i i will be taking out the agri business agri business activities for mainly for the my job will be mainly related to the agriculture sector i have to take out the uh, business uh, as banks are mainly related with the business transactions mm. so agri business activities would be taken out at that place at my no no now that uh, only not only agriculture you have to uh, focus on uh, you have to do the other part of the uh, private sector Uh, yes sir no not only agriculture i guess allied allied activities and other me uh, me yes sir agriculture allied activities. activities yes okay so the recent um, uh, your uh, budget, budget what is the allocation of that uh, agriculture budget you know so yes sir 127000 crores uh, where is the percentage of their total budget you know sorry sir i am not able to recommend 2.35% of 2.35% okay sir okay so um, you ms uh, minimum support uh, price msp yes, yes sir what does it mean uh, sir it is the minim it is the uh, price at which the government will be uh, buying that uh, buying the product from directly from the farmers as uh, the recent agitation of the farmers what is different uh, already we are paying for that msp is msp is there yes sir what is their new demand Uh, sir their demand is that uh, in our in india msp is generally the farmers are getting only for rice and wheat yeah. they want that that they should get msp for all crops uh, sir then second demand is that the india should withdraw its uh, um, agreement from wto the third is that they should they want a uh, pension pension scheme and sir the fourth uh, the actual sir, the important one is that they want a legal guarantee for that msp and no, they do not require they want a legal right that should be that uh, they will definitely get and there would be and if also the private buyers are included then only they all will be uh, farmers would be benefited by getting that msp price not below that price if uh, are you in favor of that sorry sir but uh, are you in favor of that uh, situation uh, this demands if i uh, grow grass and i want a um, msp can i uh, this this too sir if uh, so it should be crop, the crop should be benefited to the human human man uh, human or the mankind then only sir it will be uh, so what is the uh, effect of climate in agriculture uh, it depends on the uh, because the climate uh, good climate bad climate is there no yes, what sir. is that actually agriculture impact of in on agriculture yes sir Uh, so first impact of climate on agriculture is that uh, so the insect pest which were minor pest earlier they have become major pest for example aphids uh, for example the sucking pest these were not the major pests of crops but now it has become they have become the uh, major pest first thing so the second thing is uh, the uh, gradually the uh, productivity of it's a in broader sense the productivity of the crops are decreasing because uh, due to climate change if there is heavy rainfall at some places then there will be definitely leaching of the nutrients as a result of which farmer has to go for additional application of nutrients and hence it will increase its cost of cost of production so in this way it is the climate is affecting the agriculture okay so who is the father of green revolution sir uh, father of uh, indian green revolution is uh, dr m s swaminathan uh -huh. and of uh, world green revolution no sir i am only the indian green revolution no, is ms is, swaminathan he is still alive or is already yes sir he is alive he is alive swaminathan <laughs> sorry sir uh, okay it's last year yeah okay sir. Oh, sorry yeah. sir he is a great scientist and um, why so he is he was in the newspaper he is not alive but he is in the newspaper Yes, sir. Because he is going to get the highest civilian award, that is the Bharat Ratna, okay. for his immense for his immense contribution for green revolution. Then what is white revolution? It is green revolution. What is white revolution? Uh, sir, white revolution is related to the uh, milk. Uh, 
it was started by Bar- Dr. Varghis Kurian. Hmm. Uh, Operation Flood was the name of the scheme. Uh, sorry, sir, revolution. So, Abu, can you tell me you know, what is the renewable energy? But right now it is very much uh, uh, discussed. Hmm? Yes, sir. So, renewable energy is the uh, form of energy which is which can be renewed and you can be used again and again. Uh, for example, it's solar energy. Uh, currently, in uh, interim budget of 2024, uh, for it, uh, for 2024, government has uh, emphasized on the uh, on uh, rooftop uh, solar panels. Uh, rooftop solar solar panels so that the solar energy can be used as a result of which the various kinds of uh, emissions that are to the uh, atmosphere that can be reduced as well as the electricity cost for a person can be reduced. Only solar energy or any, any other energy also there? Uh, so the current uh, generated from water? Uh, hydroelectric. Hydroelectric. And wind? Yes sir, wind energy also. There are different types of Yes sir. You are a lady, yes. you will be posted in a rural area. Yes. You will be able to do your job perfectly and uh, do visit to farmers in the morning time and then in the evening time. It will be purposeful for you? Yes, sir. I will be, I will definitely, sir, I will be doing because that is my pri- pioneer, that is my priority, sir. Yes. As I have joined to that job, that is my dedication, with wholehearted dedication, I will do that job, sir. You will be uh, transported to many different places, different states, different parts of the country. Yes, sir. You will like it? Yes, sir. I am definitely ready for that. Sir, I am ready to take the challenges, whatever I will be facing in that area. I am mm-hmm. quite aware and I will definitely do it with proper ease. What type, uh, different types of loans given to the farmers in the bank? Um, so, loans first is the crop loan. Uh, it is a uh, uh, term loan or it is a uh, working capital loan or what type of loan is this? So, it is a short term loan. Short term loan. Short term loan. Okay. Crop loan. Uh, short term loan, what do you mean by short term loan? Sir, the short term loans are the loans which are to be, uh, um, which are to be, com- which has a tenure period of less than one year. One season. One season. One season okay, yes. maximum one year. Sir, they for, can... For, uh, for sugar cane? For sugar cane, uh, mm-hmm. sir, it comes under medium term loan. Yeah. Okay. Uh, sir, because it has uh, more than one and a half years it requires for in- entire starting from cultivation to marketing. So, it comes under medium term loan. Which part of the country is the highest production of uh, sugar cane? Sugar, sir, state or country, sir? State. State, sir, so Uttar Pradesh. And? Yes. And Tamil Nadu. And? Uttar Pradesh, Tamil Nadu. I think Maharashtra also. Maharashtra. Maharashtra, okay, sir, Maharashtra. For cotton? For cotton, uh, Mad- Ma- Maharashtra is highest, followed by Gujarat uh, and then Madhya Pradesh. Which, uh, which state is uh, generally called that, uh, now it is all over, that Manchester of uh, India? Manchester of India. What textile is something? Textile, sir, Gujarat. Gujarat. Yeah. Uh, what is the um, crop rotation? Why do we make crop rotation? What is the advantage? Yes. <coughs> sir, crop rotation is the practice of growing two or more uh, crops on a piece of land year after, uh, in a sequence uh, year after year. Uh, on the same piece of land. So the main advantage of crop protection is uh, first is to get uh, higher income, second so is the crop pest that would be dwelling in the soil that would be reduced uh, and so as the fertility status of the soil will also increase. And the for common uh, crop protection practice that is uh, that should be mandated is uh, cereals followed by pulses as cereals are highly uh, exhaustive crops so pulses will definitely act as the restorative crops. So, what do you mean by uh, border farming? Border farming, yes, sir. So, border farming is the uh, uh, practice in which, in the border border rows, we generally go for planting a crop, so that which mainly acts as the fence crops. Uh, perimeter crop. Perimeter, yes, sir. So that uh, the, it can be the crops can be saved from the stray animals. Okay. okay. So, the irrigation. Irrigation. Uh, which irrigation for that uh, vegetables and uh, what what type of irrigation will give? So for, for rice is different, for yes vegetables different. So for vegetables we go for check basin, check basin type of irrigation and uh, drip irrigation is com- becoming very popular nowadays okay. as uh, water efficiency is higher about 90 to 95 percent. 
followed by a sprinkler irrigation if it is grown in a greenhouse. Have you seen, have you seen sprinkler? Sprinkler, yes sir, I have so seen. What is the size of that pipe, do you know? Because you are going to bank. Sorry sir. <laughs> It's 20 feet. 20 feet, okay, sir. Sri Vidya. Yes, sir. Hmm? What I will ask, your performance is good. Huh? You are going to be selected. Thanks. Tell me one, two, three. What is scale of finance? Scale of finance. Yes sir, scale of finance is uh, the, the finance that is required for raising a crop in a unit area of land that can be acres or hectares. Uh, it, is a dis it is decided by the district level uh, DLTC, district level technical committee and it varies from district to district. What uh, is GDP? GDP. So GDP stands for uh, gross domestic product. Um, so it is the, um, the pro these, are the pro these are the products that which are confined to a particular geographical area and it adds uh, I need to work on the definition, so I am not able to recall. What is the contribution of agriculture to GDP? Uh, sir, it is nearly about 18 percent Indian GDP. What is Mudra? Mudra. Sir, uh, it is a scheme which was started by uh, Government of India. Under this, uh, it is mainly for the micro enterprises development. Under this, three categories are made. That is, uh, Kish, um, that is, uh, Kishor, Tarun, and uh, Sishu. Sishu, Kishor, and Tarun. Sishu is for the transaction. The uh, limit is up to fifty thousand. What is priority sector lending? Uh, sir, priority sector lending is the um, uh, the lending which is done to all the um, priority sectors. For example, which are mainly the backbone <coughs> of the Indian for the Indian economy. Uh, the different sectors under priority, se priority sectors are agriculture, so then MSME, uh, education, loans, housing. Uh, yes, sir, these are the okay. Wh okay. What good. are good? Uh, what is the difference between monetary policy and fiscal policy? Um, sir, I am not able to differentiate, but I can tell what, uh, what they are. Uh, sir, monetary policy is the policy uh, which is announced, by, which was started in 2016 by uh, RBI. Um, this is monetary policy is mainly for the smooth functioning of the banks which are uh, in monetary policy the various uh, rates like control repo rate. Inflation, yeah. In simple it is objective to control, control inflation. Control inflation, inflation. And, uh, okay. Haan, okay. and fiscal policy. Uh, fiscal policy. Uh, sir, fiscal policy. Who formulated it? <coughs> the government. Government. Government of India. This budget. Budget is a fiscal policy. Fiscal policy. Okay. Both income and expenditure. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Good, All the best. Thank and you. Uh, you have a right chance, just keep on updating. Fine. Uh, okay, thank you. Okay. Sir, I have one doubt actually, sir. Sir, uh, if someone asks me in the interview board that um, how will you provide a KCC loan to a farmer? On what basis will you be providing that KCC loan, sir? What we have already mean? discussed this thing scale of finance. Okay. What sir. is the acreage of land that, that farmer is holding? Okay, sir. And what is the uh, crop is going to produce. What are the types of whether sugar can produce karibo, ki paddy produce karibo. Tar yes, scale sir. of finance jati ke ho, jati ek karapal land. Jati ki loan dabo. Okay, sir. Mainly is based on the scale of finance. District, 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 district level committees there. District level committee. They are going to the base. Kung 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 crop ke tere. Okay. They will decide and they have to uh, disperse the loan according. Yeah. You yes. can also increase the scale of finance, taking the permission of the higher authority. Higher authority. Yeah. Okay, Good. sir. Thank you. Thanks. But yes. Okay. Okay. Thanks. Thanks.